They see me all the time. It's they're glad when they can see you. Ugh. Forgot my hair holder today. It is so nice to be outside. That sun feels awesome. I like their little. I don't know if you'd call that a shed or not. It almost looks with that glass door. Looks like a little house. Well, I'm sure it is. Looks like a like a little house. Nats, we're natty. I can't believe how those rabbits just sat there. That was so cool. <laughs> They're used to ya. We got tame city rabbits, I guess. Oh, they, dry, they don't actually eat carrots. They probably eat more carrot tops. People, you know, they always associate them with carrots, but it's more the carrot tops that they'll eat. Yep. If you garden, got a garden, they can be a pest unless you put human hair around your garden. I thought that was a joke first time I heard it. <laughs> it's not a joke. They don't like the scent of humans <coughs> or where they're trying to eat. Up close and personal, I don't know. Oh, mosaic? Yep. I got nice tea in there. <laughs> There's a little, oh, it looks like a little monarch, but I think it's a moth. Monarchs don't come out that tiny, <laughs> but I mean, it's got the coloration on that blade of grass. It's a moth, I'm sure, because I mean, I know there's really small butterflies, but I can't see the body on it. There it goes. I couldn't tell if it had a larger body or a smaller one. The larger body is generally a moth. We got dandelions. They're all fluffy and blowing seed around everywhere. <laughs> Hard to keep up with them. We could have dandelion salad. Yeah, except these are a little bit ripe, I think. <laughs> oh, the new ones? I have never made, nor do, want, do I want to make dandelion salad. <laughs> no, thank you. If a person has to live off of it, then it's fine. I've heard some people say it ain't bad at all. Mole or maybe a little wart or something. Hmm. 
You're getting crusty. You're getting to be a crusty old man. You didn't get any chemical on you at work, did you? Just getting to be a crusty old man. <laughs> I can't handle, I can't figure out what, I have worked with these arms and I've worked with them. I've lotioned them, I've buffed them, and I still can't get rid of that callus. <sighs> Maybe I just haven't done it enough. I don't know. We're getting old and crusty, peoples. Crusty bodies. Maybe we're getting crotchety too. Wow. I hope that isn't too hot on the camera. It shouldn't be. Huh? Ant. As long as there's not an ant hill. Well, I made two trips to candy in the kitchen today. You did? Any trucks? Bread, milk. That kind of comes every day, don't it? No? Huh. Tuesdays and Fridays. Well, that sunny is warm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is a warm one. No wonder I felt like I needed to turn on the AC. I did turn it on for a little while. But then I turned, well, I turned the thermostat back up so it wouldn't oh. keep blowing. But we're supposed to, it's supposed to be warmer now. Hopefully not any more of those cold things. I'm sorry. We should be talking to you guys. We're just being, <laughs> we're just being ourselves out here, having fun, fighting the gnats, fighting the gnats, and look at it, watching dandelion fluff. <laughs> Make me all crawly. Yeah, ants will do that. And gnats. Well, we had one gnat in the kitchen yesterday. I was like, fight that thing. The trees are so nice out here. I just, we lost our biggest shade tree, but we had to lose that thing. It was getting, <laughs> it was a monster, and it was getting in all the wires and dropping huge walnuts. Well, not huge, but just dropping huge piles of walnuts everywhere. Joe was walking on those things, and they was hurting. You got a fingernail splitting there. I get that sometimes. Not splitting, but it's... With mine, those, so sometimes the top layer will peel back when that, that happens. Yeah, I just got seven. Mm. You gotta clean your nails. Yeah. Setting when you set another day and a bird poop on me. Oh, you know what? Right in my hair. Oh, yuck. <laughs> I was watching a video one day. This is like a regular old video somebody was making. Well, vlog video. They were walking. <laughs> well, it wasn't, it's been a while. They were walking and <laughs> they've got gulls and, and stuff. <laughs> You know, the big water birds. And one of them just, just covered his whole shoulder. He's <laughs> just like, oh, gross. Did you hear about that coyote that was in, um, chased that get lady up at Holmes Lake the other day? No. Well, they're getting bold. Coyotes generally don't chase people. They'll chase small game. <laughs> Usually they're shy of people. I don't know. This one was out during the day, just chasing her. I never heard anything about the moose lately. Last time I heard anything was up in Wilbur. Moose? Yeah. This far south? There's wow. Up, up around Wilbur. Golly, Wilbur's not even that far north. <laughs> no. We have had some weird nature things happening. I think nature wants to take back over. I can't say as I blame it, but I'm sorry, we're going to rebel. <laughs> as long as it doesn't try to hurt us. 
However, with the coyotes, if they're getting that populated, they need to start calling them down. I know that doesn't sit well with some people who think we murder everything, but if you don't call them, they will kill off all kinds of species, and you don't want that either. Because once they get start getting rid of the small game, rabbits and squirrels and stuff, then the squirrels don't take care of other things, or the rabbits. I thought I saw three skunks, live ones, yesterday morning. Well, you go in early, so early morning. You don't, you don't see them until you're right up on them. I think. Not usually, and then they smell like crazy. Well, luckily, I didn't get sprayed. Mm. Was it like a family of them? No. It was in three different places. Please do subscribe and click that notification bell. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed our little fun with the bunnies today and our backyard hideaway. <laughs> it rhymed anyway. So, and share this. Share it with somebody. We'll see you Monday. Have a nice weekend. Good night. There he is.